the film I've watched most in my life. I, I think I make every new boyfriend or every new, you know, best friend sit down and watch it with me and sort of watch them. <laughs> Did you ever do that? Watching your favourite film with someone? Like the bits coming up and you're like... Are you getting it? Do you get how important it is? This? Did you see that? Um, yeah, there's, there's a... You know, it, it, is, it is Tim Burton's best. It, it's where it started. If you haven't seen it, 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 it is about... It's Halloween land and Jack the Pumpkin King, you know, sort of rules over it as this hero and he goes for a walk with his dog Zero one day through the woods and finds these trees and they're all different holidays and he discovers for the first time in what seems to be centuries something new and it's, it's funny because I, you know, growing up in the Sutherland Shire and kind of being on repeat, very much repeat in what I was doing I remember watching it for the first time, it's a really distinct moment in my life and I, I broke down in tears at the oddest moment when he said that. Um, he said, look, Zero, it's something new. And I just remember I, I shook with excitement over that idea of finding something new and something special for yourself. Um, and so, he, he, you know, obviously he finds Christmas lands and try, tries to introduce it to, to Halloween town and, and he hasn't quite grasped it has yeah he? he doesn't quite get it he puts on the suit and he tries to play up as santa and completely fails at playing a different role which is you know a wonderful um a wonderful message for people to 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 fail sometimes mm -hmm. i think it's one of the first films that i watched where the lead character failed so miserably um in what was a very positive thing to try and do, try and introduce Christmas to Halloween. Um, and, and so again, without maybe, without maybe even knowing it was about, it was a film about identity. But then you have, have Sally, it's one of the most beautiful scenes in the film where she's stuck with the mad professor and you certainly don't pick up on it on the first time you watch it, but there's a part where Sally throws herself out the window um, and then picks herself up and, and sews her arm back on. And I, I must have been maybe the third time I watched it, maybe when I was 16 or 17, realising what that message was and what, how, how Tim Burton was getting away with these Shakespearean messages and delivering it to young people, which I think is so underrated. I think it's so underrated showing adult messages to young people. I think it's so exciting what kids get out of it.